this is one that we got very little marketing for. This is our Christmas mural. Mm-hmm. Our Christmas mural. When single mom Olivia is secretly entered into a mural contest by her mother, she partners with the teacher, Will. I liked that we got a little bit more of a story involving the son. Because with Olivia's son in here, there's a nice chemistry built between him and his teacher. If you would have just had him there and not done anything, then this movie would have felt completely flat on its face. But I enjoyed this more as a friendship piece along with the bit of romance we did get, but I just didn't care for the art storyline at all. I thought that the mural was a little bit forgotten about. I'm not a fan of like art. Well, see, I can't really say I'm not a fan of artsy films. I mean, Cruella, <laughs> Once My Time in Hollywood. I mean, I got a West Side Story poster too, too there and right there uh, on, on the other side of me right now. But just art-based films about art, I don't really enjoy those films pretty much rarely. But what works for me in this film is the friendship built between the teacher and uh, and the son. Because that relationship is so important and so integral to, to this plot, to building the romance. Because the son doesn't really have a father figure and... He's acting like a father figure. He's he's helping him with his issues. But I will just say this. This is a okay film that I don't think I'll be re-watching every year. If it's on, I may turn it on, but, but it's not one I'm going to go out of my way to watch. L- like I will um, a Hall of the Holly or a Three Wise Men. This yeah. is a right in the middle, middle of the road christmas hallmark film but what did you think about this film um i think that the chemistry was there i did laugh a couple times in it uh, i like the the friendship between the kid and and him our, our main guy um my biggest thing was i want uh, kind of a trend i wanted more from our side couple that they were sort of somewhat building but they didn't really do a good job at it it just kind of got ignored a little too much for me i wish i got a little more with them um and then the mural part of it i do feel like they could have focused a little bit more on it they didn't really show enough of them working together on it. They, they do like a little montage once she finally figures out what she wants to do. Mm-hmm. But, um, you know, cause she has that creative block as she calls it, called it in here. Mm-hmm. Um, which when she kind of broke out of the creative block, I felt like they did that. Okay. I think they could have gave us a little more to her. Why she broke out of that creative block kind of explained it a little better. Mm-hmm. Gave us a little more explanation for that, but um, I still enjoyed it. I thought it, it still worked. I ended up giving it a, a three and a half out of five. I know I think that was probably higher than yours, mm-hmm. but um, it definitely wasn't one that wowed me in any way. I can definitely see people just saying that this one's boring. I could definitely see you know the the hate for it some just because it 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 also in a way didn't feel like a Christmas movie exactly. It kind of just felt like an art movie Mm -hmm. pretty much. Um, But it still had the heart. It still had some comedy, the chemistry. Cinematography was fine, even though it wasn't really Christmassy. Uh, At least it was at least better than the Notting Hill. (laughs) Yeah. uh, But it it, overall was an okay. It was a fine film that I might would watch every once in a while, but definitely not like something I'm going to rush to see again anytime soon. Mm-hmm. 